Alcatraz is the harshest slammer in the United States. During its run from 1934 to 1963, judges sentence America's nastiest criminals there, like Al Capone and that trigger-happy sadist, Machine Gun Kelly. But it's also home to Robert Stroud, the gentle convict we now know better as the Birdman of Alcatraz, whose inventive work with birds on the rock inspires a best-selling book and a movie starring Burt Lancaster. Many inmates try to escape from Alcatraz, but the tight security and strong tides of San Francisco Bay foil every desperate attempt. The myths in that recap deserve a life sentence. Starting with that last claim, the fact is that dozens of convicts escape from Alcatraz, but only in the era before it becomes a federal penitentiary. From 1907 to 1933, it's an army prison. Busting out then is a whole lot easier. Military prisoners aren't really the baddest of the bad guys, just guys who had bad attitudes or didn't salute. So it was more of a minimal security facility. The records aren't really totally clear, but at least 90 men tried to escape. And at least 62 were never seen again. A lot of men escaped from Alcatraz. During the day, most of the military prisoners have the run of the island leaving the door open for anyone with the guts and the simplest of schemes. They'd simply strip off their uniform and steal a regular soldier's uniform from the laundry, and they'd walk onto a boat, disappear. The slickest escape of this era is authored by four inmates in 1903, who work in the Alcatraz printing room. In the prison print shop, they printed out these forms and uh, a couple guys in the prison print shop realized what they were is they were recommendations for release. So they forged the commandant's name, mailed the recommendation for release to the War Department in Washington, and they were approved. But after The Rock becomes a maximum security pen in 1934, escapes like that exist only in a convict's dreams. That's why so many judges condemn the country's gnarliest crooks to Alcatraz. Uh, objection, Your Honor. Courts couldn't send you to Alcatraz. Alcatraz, that was reserved for prisoners who were already within the federal penitentiary system and sent to Alcatraz for special isolation. Alcatraz was the prison system's prison. The bad prisoners, the ones who acted out or killed a guard, or the worst of the worst. For whatever reason, when a warden wanted to get rid of a bad prisoner in his prison, he was sent to Alcatraz.